Acacia's Dejection is a legendary trace rifle added to Destiny 2 as part of the Root of Nightmares raid. This one is an absolutely incredible solar trace rifle that can roll with incandescent plus. Trace rifles are on the up and up these days in the sandbox right now. Well today I want to check out the stats and the perks the Garros to chase for PvP and PvE, plus also have a look at how to get a Cassius Dejection in Destiny 2. Well, if you're new around here or find this useful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell and roughly 95% of viewers who watch this week in video games aren't subscribed. So subscribe today and never miss an update. Okay, let's get right to it. So how to get a Cassius Dejection. So to get this legendary trace rifle, you have to run the Root of Nightmares raid, which has arrived as part of the Lightfall expansion. So you can get this weapon from the second and the third encounter, which are the Ascision and the Planets encounter. And you also have the chance to get the weapon from the final boss at the end of the raid. Once you get the weapon, you'll also be able to get it from the secret chest found in the raid. However, it does have to be in your loot pool before you can get it to drop in any of the secret chests. Okay, next up, let's have a look at Acacia's Dejection in a little bit more detail. So this one is a legendary energy trace rifle with an adaptive frame, meaning it's got a well-rounded grip, it's reliable and it's sturdy. So looking at these stats, we've got 6 for impact, 69 for range, 80 for stability, 59 for handling, 53 for reload speed, 13 for airborne effectiveness. It's got 1,000 rounds per minute with 98 in the magazine. Well, the origin trait on the Root of Nightmares weapons is called Harmonic Resonance, so equipping multiple weapons from this set grants this weapon increased reload speed and handling. It also deals increased damage versus Tormentors, Lucent Hive, and Guardians using their super. Okay, next up, let's have a look at the Acacia's Dejection God Roll Guide. So for PvE, Fluted Barrel, Enhanced Battery, Rewind Rounds, and Incandescent would be good. So Fluted Barrel greatly increases handling speed and slightly increases stability. Enhanced Battery, well that increases the magazine size. Rewind Rounds, so when the weapon's magazine is empty, it refills from reserves based on the number of hits. And then you've got Incandescent, absolutely fantastic perk for solar weapons. So defeating a target spreads Scorch to those nearby, and more powerful combatants and opposing guardians cause Scorch in a larger radius. For PvP, Fluted Barrel, Enhanced Battery, Perpetual Motion and High Impact Reserves would be good. So Fluted Barrel greatly increases the handling speed and slightly increases stability. Then you've got Enhanced Battery, increases the magazine size. Perpetual Motion, so the weapon gains bonus stability, handling and reload speed while the wielder is in motion. And then High Impact Reserves, so rounds at the end of the magazine deal more damage. Let me know in the comments what you think of the Acacia's Dejection, plus... Let me know your favourite roles. Well, that is it for this guide for how to get the Acacia's Dejection in Destiny 2. And as always, thank you so much for watching or listening. Well, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you real soon.